in the pyramid that you made. You spent like a couple of hours working on that pyramid. Okay, yeah. So, so what, what? Overall, what's 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 happened? So basically, we tried to come up with interactive quiz so that the kid don't feel very uh, boring when learning about nutrition. Right. So now we have actually got some of the the, the, the quiz games. Yeah. So getting implemented. Is, so the kids can try and drop to see this is the this is the nutrition pyramid. Right. So it could tell you how much uh, category food you should consume. So for example here. Right. So the so the base will consume more so cool. this is not correct because you cannot consume more okay. vegetable. So basically you should eat more rice. Okay, chicory not blooded. <laughs> the chicory not blooded. Well, because internet, the internet problem. Connection. Yeah, we're having continuous internet problems. So, <laughs> what about this game here with the with the touch? That's kind of well, cool. Well, so um, I'm trying to implement the walk walk a mole. Walk a mole. Walk a mole. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it works now. The touch screen work with some problem, but basically it works to score. The cat is good and the donut is bad. So <laughs> when you touch the donut, you get minus point. When you touch the cat, you get. What, why? Why store. not like healthy food instead of a cat? Well, because or, these or are the only two pictures I have on my computer, <laughs> so I want to use it for now. Uh, I'll worry about the pictures later. So it's nothing to do with eating cats. Yep, it's nothing to do with eating cats. Okay. <laughs> All right. Cool. Yep. Okay, that was teams and.